Hello there guys and welcome, welcome back to the channel. So Kaban just dropped the animation reveal for Infamous Iron Man and Titania. Now this time around, unfortunately, we can't really gather too much information from the hints that they typically write down on their special attack effects where they used to kind of mention specific debuffs that can get inflicted or some mechanics that, you know, those special attacks revolve around. But we can still see the classes of these champions and we can still see the general animations. So first, let's watch this entire clip in its entirety and then kind of go over some of the point things to point out. Uh, so I definitely also want to point out that it is just excellently animated. I do think these animations are amazing and that animation department is brilliant. So Victor Van Doom is gonna be tech. And Titania is science. Now, these are finally some good Iron Man animations. So first of all, let's uh, break down and take a look at Titania's animations themselves, which I do think are fairly straightforward. Uh, I mean, I'm sure they're going to look great, but just from the player's perspective, I don't think it is going to be the hardest thing in the world to await them. So I'm going to mute the volume here. So you can see that uh, the special attacks both basically seem kind of like melee attacks with like a leap forward where you just would need to dex out of the way the same thing with level two just kind of stay out of the way and when she leaps forwards you should probably just need dex in time now the level three thing i'm not sure what do you guys think are they getting carried away with the chair i know some people are mega fans of the chair and that's like the coolest thing in the universe but now we already have quicksilver who has chair in his special three and now titania quite literally just smacks people with the chair it also is implied that obviously since Titania is a science champion and here we can say that the special three hurling them into wall littered with debuffs means that Titania will have access to like a large amount or multiples of different debuffs. So those are Titania's animations. I'm going to be 100% honest. You know, I think they're fine. I don't think there's anything wrong with them. But animation wise, Dr. Doom definitely wins, especially with this level two animation that's about to come. So level one is kind of some hits and a beam. And then level two, we have boots to the face. <laughs> so let's check that out again. So level two is going to be, look at that. Boots to the face and then arc reactor like blast type of thing. And then the level three, obviously, he just gets pissed off when he gets punched and absolutely nukes in. <laughs> I, I have to say it looks very, very cool. Very good. Also, looking at these animations, I really hope that they rework both iron man and superior iron man and give them proper animations finally and uh i know that would be the ideal situation right where they would rework superior iron man and give them new animations rework iron man give those guys new animations as well but in this case again i really don't mind that it is yet another iron man ish character because this is just so freaking dang cool i know that there are some people who are massive fans of titania again i don't really have much of an impression with her uh, at least up until now obviously i still hope that both of them are amazing and great champions so these have been their animations let me know what you guys think uh, again i personally really like infamous iron man animations definitely more i really do hope that he's going to be an amazing champion as well and uh yeah i think it was a great showcase of their attacks 
and uh, let me know what you guys think about it and how do you guys enjoy it. I'm going to catch you guys later. See ya. Hello there guys and welcome back to the channel. So we have all the information about the 